Okay, so here we have Irish Yew. And Irish Yew is by far one of the most beautiful woods we work with in the workshop. Um, just from the color of it, the grain, the um, the cool burls and, and knots and patterns you get in it. It's just, it's a fantastic wood. So, yeah, I'm really excited to show you guys. So, uh, let's get into it. So, this is the Dakota Irish box. Uh, great solution for storing the box or carrying it around if you're going places. So, you know, you have a, a nice package box and a really good storage solution. That's a win-win. So, very first here, before we jump into it, just to show you, we're looking at Irish U with green suede. So, yeah. And the first thing you do when you open it up, you get information about you as well as my commitments on the quality and craftsmanship of the product. Just to talk a little bit about you, I won't ruin it for you. You can read through it more if you get it. But you is one of the few indigenous uh, conifer trees to Ireland. It's also considered one of the sacred trees for pagan uh, beliefs. And uh, even uh, Christian beliefs also, they would there'd be superstitions around you. So a lot of times you'll find you in graveyards or at places that might have been former sacred sites. And they'll last for a long time. They won't be cut down. So it's really rare because the only way you're going to get your hands on you is when it gets cut, uh, or excuse me, when it falls down and then it gets cut up. So it's a rare wood to get your hands on. So it's always exciting to see it. And, uh, yeah, can, uh, you'll see here in a minute, there's some really cool stuff that can happen with you. So here's the care instructions just on how to look after the tray and depending on what lining you chose for it. So here it is. The, uh, tissue paper. Kind of keeps it safe, keeps blemishes from happening to it, you know, as it's if it's bouncing around or whatever, and also it looks nice. It's a nice way to open it up. So, here we go. Already you can see that beautiful green suede in there. And it's just this tray. I know the video doesn't, it's kind of coming top down, and I'm kind of coming in from the side, but man, the, it just comes popping out of this um, gold paper. Like, it's just amazing. So, here it is. Irish U. And I'm just going to be quiet for a second and just give you an all around on this tray. So Irish U is a really special wood because it's so old. You oftentimes will see things like this and, and this red in it. And that comes from nails that have oxidized in the wood. And that's what creates it, because normally you has this beautiful orange and cream color. Um, you can see the knot knots there and the and the beautiful open grain on it. But the red comes from the nail oxidizing, and that actually happens because oftentimes they will uh, attach fences or signs to the tree. And uh, the, the reason they attach fences is actually because the uh, berries of you is um, is toxic for cows and stuff so they tend to do that to keep the cows away from it but yeah so you could have a nail that was hundreds of years old in this tree oxidizing creating this beautiful red color in the wood it's absolutely fantastic it's a really special tray it's got lovely high quality rubber feet on it to keep it from moving when it's on the table um, it's got a fine beautiful finish shellac finish protects it seals it there's three coats of shellac on it. You can roll metal dice in this tray and you're not going to cause damage to it uh, because of that shellac coating on it. And it won't pit it or damage it like you would if you had an oil-based uh, finish on it like some of my competitors. Also, you have this beautiful green suede. So suede is really the backside of a piece of leather, right? And uh, that's where you get this beautiful kind of uh, lovely texture and and you know, kind of lovely soft texture to it. It's a it's a thick Italian leather. It's a green, uh, dark green leather, and it's about three and a half mil thick, and it's really cushiony, really lovely. Um, just dice roll beautifully in them. So, yeah. So that's it, guys. I won't spoil it anymore for you if you decide to get an Irish U tray. It's uh, definitely a treat. It's a huge statement piece of the table, uh, and it's, yeah, it's absolutely beautiful. You can't go wrong if you get yourself one of these trays. So, yeah, there you go, guys. Irish you.